me. That was a poor timing on my part. Hello, happy Saturday from Mayor. Um, let me adjust this a little bit. I think things moved a little on their own. There we go. That's probably better. Better, better, better. Hi. So it's a Saturday, guitar day. Um, yesterday I said I was going to do the daddy dance today, but actually I'm going to do it tomorrow. And then um, tomorrow's special um, event at around 4 o'clock, I'll post it. Doc Rock's going to go online live, and if you want to see my other side when I'm acting like an adult, <laughs> um, you can tune into that. So, I'm going to sing some songs today that were traditional folk songs. Now, folk songs are songs that are passed down from generation to generation, generally by word of mouth. They were not ever really written down until recently. Um, they're usually songs where you really can't trace who the author was. It's just something that everybody always sang. And um, in going through them, I found that a lot of the words are um, not necessarily words we would want to use with children today. Um, so I'm going to um, modify them. Yes. And um, let's see. I might need a little bit of help with some of them in remembering all the words because I haven't sung them in a long time. And I just had this idea a few minutes ago. You see what happens if I come up real close to you here. Uh, you can't see the guitar much, but now I can see the chords. <clears throat> this song is called, It Ain't Gonna Rain. Yeah, and sometimes the words are not really the best English. Hi, Rose, I'll bet you know this song. It ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain no more. How the heck can I wash my neck if it ain't gonna rain no more? I had a cat, I named him Tom, let him out one day. A big dog chased him down the street and Tom ran away. Tom came back, big and fat, how that cat did purr. Now how on earth could Tom give birth? I guess he was a her. It ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain no more. How the heck can I wash my neck if it ain't gonna rain no more? I made a garden on my roof and weeded it each day. Prayed for rain, but when it came, it washed my roof away. But it ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain no more. Now I suppose I could pick a rose, it ain't gonna rain no more. Oh, I like to sing this silly song and make up verses too. It's no offense if it make no sense. Well, I can, so can you. It ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain no more. It ain't gonna snow and it ain't gonna pour, it ain't gonna rain no more. It ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain, it ain't gonna rain no more. How the heck can I wash my neck if it ain't gonna rain? I'm glad you're doing okay too. Uh, Florida has been getting a little bit wild lately, but um, you know, I'm following the rules because I care not only about myself, but I care about other people too, you know? Hi, Sylvia and everyone else that's joining. I'm singing songs today that are old traditional songs and songs that maybe kids today don't know and maybe we should start doing those again getting around at night and putting drums and shakers out and someone plays guitar you know you don't need a guitar or a piano you can just do all rhythm and sing songs and i used to love this song when i was a little girl how much is that doggy in the window oh i 
run with the waggly tail. How much is that dog in the window? I wonder if he is for sale. Okay, now you guys gotta bark for me. Every time you go, how much is that dog in the window? The one with the waggly tail. How much is that dog in the window? I wonder if he is for sale. Now if I go and get that doggy, so I can give him a home, then that doggy can live with me, and neither one of us will be alone. So how much is that dog in the window? The one with the waggly tail. How much is that dog in the window? I wonder if he is for sale. I went inside to see that doggy. He jumped up and he licked me. Now I am taking him home. And we both are surely happy. How much is that dog in the window? The one with the waggly tail. How much is that dog in the window? I mean, you're barking. I wonder if he is for sale. Hi, Kelly. I'm singing songs today that I wonder if little kids nowadays ever get to hear these songs anymore. Now, Doggy in the Window, I did change the words a little bit. I made it more compatible with our things that today where we're adopting pets and um, going in and finding dogs that don't have homes and cats and giving them homes. So that's what that song um, was about. And I just switched it up a little bit. Now here's a song called The Little White Duck. And this is a song that Burl Ives made famous. Oh man, that's a really long time ago. But um, when my daughter was little, Zoya was little, we had, uh, there was an album out called For the Children, which was raising money for AIDS. Um, hi, Sylvia. And um, one of the things that um, so they did was every, they took songs from everywhere that were made for children over the years. And, it, and this song was on there with Burl Ives. You see how I do because I haven't sung this in so long. I'm a little white duck sitting in the water. A little white duck doing what he ought her. He took a bite, the lily pad. The little duck bit, he said, I'm glad. I'm a little white duck sitting in the water. Quack, quack, quack. What's the duck say, everybody? Let me hear you quacking. I'm a little green frog sitting in the water. Brit. A little green frog doing what he ought to. Brit. He jumped right off the lily pad that the little duck said, where the little duck said, and he said, I'm glad that I'm a little green frog sitting in the water. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. That's Mr. Froggy's favorite verse. I'm a little black bug floating on the water. A little black bug doing what he ought to. Let's see. It took a bite of the lily pad that the little duck, where the little duck said, and he said, I'm glad that I'm a little black bug doing what I ought to. Chirp, chirp, chirp. Uh-oh, uh-oh. You know what's coming along? Here we go. There's a little red snake Lying in the water, a little red snake. 
doing what he ought her. He frightened the duck and the frog so bad that the little and he ate the little bug and he said, I'm glad that I'm a little red snake lying in the water. Guess what happened then? The duck, the frog, the bug, they're all hanging out together to the snake king, right? Now there's nobody left <laughs> lying in the water. Nobody left <laughs> doing what they are. There's nothing left on the lily pad cause the duck and the frog ran away. It's sad. There's nobody left sitting in the water. Boo, boo, boo. So those are um, three songs that um, I loved to sing when I was little. I haven't sung them in so long. And I thought, all right, I'm gonna try it today. Um, but to be honest, I didn't even think of this till about 12, 15. And then I thought, all right, let's see what happens. So this one, I'm going to have to turn a page at some point. I used to love to sing this. And I think that, oh, here's a name that you guys would never, I don't think many people know, but the Andrew sisters sang this song. I, I used to love to watch the Andrew sisters when I was a little girl. I did. And this was a song where you have to go, oh! So if you all do that, like, you know, I guess the most recent uh, artist with that one is you know, is Cindy Lauper. Oh! Um, okay, so. for us to sing these kind of things with our kids. So to put this on, 
and just sing with the kids and have them make the animal noises with me. I'm going to put it up on YouTube and then you can watch it whenever you want. Alrighty, so um, tomorrow we're going to learn how to do the daddy dance because it is Father's Day. And um, I will be back then with a tribute to daddy with some of the songs. Hi, AJ, you just missed it. I'm just finishing. So you're just going to have to watch it on replay. Um, all right, everybody. Thank you for signing on. See you tomorrow for Daddy Dance. And um, thank you. Bye.